When we were first recording, I was wearing a bag on my head. As long as we're great at what we do, we'll be accepted. We didn't know we might become role models but it's good that we did because if you're put in a position like this, you should try to make a difference because a lot of kids today don't have role models. In any business, you get your numbers together before you go out and do the work. I just want credit for my ideas, because I am the creative force behind TLC. I hope we go down in history for being something more than just another famous act that got ripped off. The truth is, women don't stand up, they're too hushed, they don't like to say stuff. We did want to stand for something, not just cute girls with cute concepts. Everything we talk about has meaning behind it. We're not hardcore feminists. We like men and we like to have fun with them. But we also want men to think about females in different ways. The magic of the group has everything to do with the chemistry between myself, Tion and Chili. With TLC, it's like, if there wasn't something going wrong, it just wouldn't be right. Let it be understood that I am interested in making multi-million dollar business deals. Too many kids think condoms are nasty and vulgar instead of is something that can save your life. Everything that we know in the business we've had to learn from mistakes. No one sat us down and taught us or even said, go pick up this book and learn for yourself. We trusted people. We try to teach women how to be strong, how to believe in themselves, how to make themselves happy as opposed to pleasing someone else first. You know I've been called crazy. Kids listen to performers and we have a duty to give them certain critical information. Whether it's positive or negative press, it's all good. I do understand the game. This is a cutthroat business full of greedy individuals who take advantage of naive young artists. There are plenty of groups that have come out and did whatever they did and have broken up. Especially girls groups. Now we know that, the way contracts are set up, it's not really made for artists to get rich from selling records. That's the company's one shot to make money.